The work product doctrine does not provide absolute protection for the documents or evidence, however. By marshalling the appropriate facts to show undue hardship, an opponent may be able to overcome the work product protection. Again, Hickman v. Taylor sets the standard for this. A party who is unable to access documents or evidence because they are protected by the work product doctrine must show that the evidence sought is only available through the discovery process and that it is necessary and indispensable for either impeaching or substantiating a claim. A good example of this is when a witness or person relevant to the litigation has died or moved out of the jurisdiction of the court. A lawyer who met with the person and created charts or materials in connection with their meeting may be required to disclose them even though they are work product. 